Hey, good afternoon, everybody. Once again, no camera, unfortunately, for this particular setup, but should be fine. Excuse me, just stirring up. So yeah, I'm gonna try and finish Fusion within this first hour, which I think should be manageable. Um, I don't know, there's something I'm supposed to do over here. Whoops. I literally thought last time, I was like, maybe I shouldn't go to the navigation room, because I'm not going to remember next time. I'm like, yeah, it'll be fine. It's not fine. Really wasn't fine. Oh, well. Uh, I think there's something down here. Is that guy? Is that a little guy? Hmm. Uh, there we go. Huh. Yeah, I guess I gotta go from the other side. Oh, or do some with that. Pretty sure that's the last thing I'm gonna unlock here, so should be cool. Um, yeah, looking. I saw some other people got advanced copies of Metroid Dread that they're streaming. I don't get it till tomorrow, or maybe not advanced copies. Maybe it's like a pre-order thing because we were able to get uh, Far Cry 6 last night. And I, I played the the beginning of that, the first like mission or so. Not too far in it, you know, still in the tutorial area basically. But uh, I'm enjoying that. I liked Far Cry 5 a lot. Uh, I haven't really played any of the other Far Cries so much. That's that's just how it's going for me. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we gotta. I don't want to. I don't want to run back and admit that I probably should have. Um, probably should have did the navigation room, but let's let's continue onward. At worst, I'll just look at the walkthrough on my phone, rather than waste everybody's time backtracking. Uh, maybe I can do that with. That? Nope. That's just one of the ones that falls out from underneath you. All right. I am currently going in the right direction. It was here? Yes. Okay. Yeah, there are parts of that room I haven't explored, so I presume that's where I'm supposed to go. If I get there and it's I'm wrong, then oops. Not a lot more I can say. To be honest. Ah, boy. Had a long week so far, but it is, it's good to play video games. Video games is fun. And this is this is an exceptionally fun video game. Really, really loving this. Uh, right. Remember that whole situation. Hold up. Just gonna, oh, it's like a scary face back there. That's cute. And, yeah, okay. Yep, I messed up. Hold on, let me see. Uh, oh, where's my phone at? It's on the other side of the room, one sec. Oh, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Okay, okay. Let me see here. Sector five, I'm in sector six. So, we're going a little bit past that. No. Yeah, this is the, the third to last section of the game. So, we're we're making pretty good progress. Come on. I don't want to sign in or anything. Just let me... Please, let me just read the fucking article. God. News websites of any kind, especially like IGN, are just a fucking nightmare nowadays. 
It's all just a million ads. Like, let me just get to the content. The reason you made... Like, even if you made this content specifically... Ju just fucking sell ad space... You have to actually make me want to read the content... To get me to look at the ads. A word to the wise. Your computer reports... Just make matters worse. Into the dead ends into the top of a vertical shaft. To the right? The middle hatch along the left wall. What are they talking about? Okay, I guess I'm in the wrong area entirely. Come on, do the second jump, Samus. Ooh, I hate that. How she won't do the fucking second jump sometimes. not the way to go, I guess. All right. Making my way back up. I'm still good, I think. I mean... Uh, who's that falling? Who's that falling on my head? I ain't here for that. this shaft. Pretty sure it's just higher up than this. Hold on a sec. Uh, let's fix this mic a little bit. I'm getting some plosives and I don't like that. I guess it's over here? Get him. Super easy. Super easy. Don't even gotta worry about him. Right. No, this isn't the right place. Okay. I gotta go back to the navigation room because the IGN walkthrough was friggin' stupid. I was just like, go right. And I did go right, and then that's not the place. What do they mean here? I think this is where they meant? Hold on. <sighs> the middle hatch along the left wall. Okay, so they mean the one... Down here? Yeah, here, I guess. Ah, yep, that's it. Okay, okay. We've done it, we've found it. We're moving forward. All right, let's let's travel downwards. Ah, dang, now that 
Or wait, actually, I think I can... Hold on, maybe this? No. Ah, oh, whatever. I got 135. I think I'm solid. Any secrets? Nope. Oh well. Sometimes there ain't secrets. I don't know. Hmm? Well, I'm gonna go through... Okay, that's a save point. Uh, about ten minutes in. I think I'm making decent enough time. God. Small fry enemies like that are always such an annoyance in the late game. Like, early on, they're like, oh, it's really a threat. But then, like, at this point in the game, it's just like, get out of here. Uh. No entry without authorization. Uh. Warning. No entry without authorization. Warning. We got to hit the fire button. Warning. No entry without authorization. Um, okay, let's find out what this deal is. Warning. No entry without authorization. 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 Oh, okay. I just have to leave. Warning. No entry without authorization. 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 Come on. Sam S. No entry without authorization. Oh, there it is. That's what I wanted to hear. Warning. No entry without authorization. Warning. No entry without authorization. Alright, where am I playing this guy? Oh, there he is. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, fine. I'm just gonna look up how to fight him. Oh, god damn it. As usual, there's like some fucking untelegraphed secret. There we go. Jesus. Alright, 
let's ret retry because we're like right, right here. Let's hit another save here, no entry just in case. Authorization. Warning, no entry without 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 authorization. All right, Coming back into this fight as strong as we can. Save state right here. This might take me a couple tries. Damn it! Ah, this is one of those bosses. One of those bosses is just pain in the ass. Stop! Stop it! Let me up! Stop it! God! Just let me up! Ah. Just gonna reset. This is just the most annoying type of boss. The kind that like puts you in a precarious friggin' footing and then just won't let you keep it. Like it's hard enough just maintaining the footing. And then I also have this guy like constantly messing up my steeds. Let me up! My God, she's doing the freaking stupid little hops again. A uh, jump, jump, jump. Jump, oh my God, Sam, it's fucking jump. Oh my god! It's annoying sh piece of shit! Get him, get him! I don't know how that spread is not fucking hitting all of the missiles.
Come on. Oh, God damn it. Stop it. Stop. God. Ah, oh, this guy's so annoying. Me up, let me up. Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. God, oh my god! Asshole. You asshole! Let me up! Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. There would be literally nothing challenging about this fucking boss if it weren't for the fact that he keeps fucking doing that! Stop it! It doesn't feel fucking... It doesn't feel like a challenge. It feels fucking annoying. It feels fucking obnoxious, like somebody flicking at your fucking ear over and over again, and you keep telling them to fucking stop, and they just fucking keep doing the little fucking thing. Oh my god, and she doesn't fucking jump half the time! Come on. Come on, shoot out your bullshit. Come on. God, oh my god, let me up! Let me up! Fuck's sake, Samus, jump! I hit the fucking jump button! I expect her to fucking jump! Not just do a weird little half jump hop! Why the fuck is that even in there? Why is that a fucking thing in the programming that she can even fucking do that? Jump! Jump! I fucking hit the jump button like seven times! Oh my god, fucking jump! Fucking jump! Oh my god. I'm just gonna start this one over. Seriously, it wouldn't be fucking any kind of difficult. I'd have no problem if it, she would fucking jump when I hit jump! But sometimes she just doesn't fucking hit jump! She just does a weird little hop, or she doesn't fucking leave the ground at all! Literally, the whole danger here is just staying on the fucking thing. There's like no danger from the actual boss. Oh god damn it, my fucking monitor! Up, 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 jump! Jump, jump, Samus, fucking jump! My fucking god. One second. One second. I'm gonna switch my monitor over to a different fucking... All right. Seriously. It, it's just that she won't fucking jump sometimes. 
Like, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing wrong. I hit the fucking jump button and she just doesn't jump. God, see? There, there. Why the fuck? Why the fuck did she not jump? She just did a weird little hop that barely even fucking hit the top of the water. Why? Why is that a fucking option? Why is that possible? Who the fuck programmed that? Jump, jump, oh my god. Jump! Holy shit, why the fuck, why the fuck does it not jump sometimes? Sincerely, I've played this entire fucking game. There's never been a point where they're just like, you won't jump if you fucking do this bullshit or something. It just fucking doesn't work sometimes. And like in a game that has such precise fucking combat, it's kind of important that I know why the fuck my movement isn't working consistently. Okay, okay, let's fucking save, save, okay. Nope. Oh my god, oh my god, fucking jump. Fucking jump. Every goddamn time. Why the fuck doesn't she jump? This is bullshit. I fucking hate this whole core X mechanic. Like, it's cute. It's cute thematically. Whatever. Fucking. It's so annoying. I fucking did the boss. Why the fuck do I have to do a second little mini boss after the fucking boss? That's not fun. That's not fucking. Cool! It fucking sucks! Because I'm already worn the fuck out from the actual boss I already fought. I don't want a second little boss to fight. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, fucking hit him, hit him, hit him. Robot! Jump, jump, Samus, you fucking idiot. God, oh my god, just let me get one. Just let me get one. I'm like fucking right there. Just let me hit him. Just hit him. God damn it. The fucking gap is so precise. I'm like fucking always like a pixel or two off. Just fucking hit him. Ah! God, I fucking shot, like, directly at him, like, seven times, but because the fucking gap is so fucking precise. Jesus Christ. Okay, that's better. That's technically better, so let's fucking try that. Let's see if I can fucking survive this time. Oh my god, jump! Nothing, nothing in the world pisses me off more than fucking technology, like a video game, not doing what it's fucking meant to do. Fucking computers work specifically the way you fucking tell them to. So if it doesn't work the way that it's fucking supposed to, that means somebody fucked up. Somebody actively fucking fucked up and programmed it wrong. That's it. That's literally it. It can't do shit that it didn't, they didn't fucking tell it to do. So fucking I'm just it's just fucking means that some asshole did the shit wrong if it doesn't fucking work consistently like it should do exactly what it's fucking meant to do every fucking time with consistency
And if I'm fucking losing because it's doing shit inconsistently, who the fuck else am I supposed to blame? Like, I'm literally hitting the button in the same fucking way every goddamn time. It's the only fucking button that's supposed to do the thing. I, there's not anything else I can fucking do, but sometimes it just doesn't fucking work. And this is a precision fucking game. Like, you can't have a game this precise, and then sometimes shit just doesn't fucking work! Oh my god, just fucking... Just fucking grab it! Samus! Samus! As far as I can tell, it's like if you're holding any direction that isn't directly up or directly to the right. It's just like, nah, nah, that doesn't count. That doesn't count as a fucking direction you can jump in, so, uh, fuck you. And like, just fuck off. Just let me fucking jump. Just let me jump regardless of where the fucking buttons are pointing. Why the fuck would it not just default to up? It's a jump. God, and the fact that you have to look it straight in the fucking eye where it's gonna shoot you to shoot it! Just like consistently, consistently, you have to look exactly where it's going to hit you and there's no time to react. You have to point directly into its fucking muzzle. It's like you're fucking literally having to like go gun tip to gun tip on this and they're gonna fucking shoot regardless and their shit's just gonna go right through yours my god I fucking was doing it I was fucking doing the button <sighs> you basically have to jump before the fucking Missile lands. God, oh my god, just fucking get hit! Why the fuck does it get to move so freely? Oh my god, grab the shit. No, no, no. Okay, I'm in a rhythm. Oh, fucking finally! Wave beam. Cool. Thank you. I've wanted one of those. It's good. It's good. That's what I want. Holy shit. Wait, no, 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 there was a spot, right? Oh, fuck you guys. There was like a spot. Yeah, over there. For the, uh, the missile. Warning, no entry without authorization. Warning. Missile no tank. All right. No entry okay, let's keep going. I'm I'm very close to the end of this. I know that no SAX fight is gonna be a friggin' nightmare. No 
Warning. No Shut up! Why you keep telling me this? I know, no entry, authorization, the whole thing. Give me a minute. I'll be there. Ah, boy. Oh, they do a little explosion. God, there it is. Why the fuck does she do the little hop sometimes? I don't want her to do a little hop. I want her to do the full fucking jump. Okay, another safe room. Cool. The Metroids! Of course. I saw it coming. Oh wait, that room is actually taller. I guess? Well, I guess I'll be up on the top of it in a bit. Oh, what's that guy? Ooh. Oh, wait. Okay, I recognize them. Uh oh. That's probably not good. Uh, I'm gonna guess I should get out of here. Oh, I can't. Oh no. I guess I gotta run this way. Oh no! Oh, they got her. Detachment? Oh no! It's, they do not die, so you just gotta, you just gotta dodge your way through them. Oh, this sucks. Oh, this really sucks. Oh, no. Oh, God, I've wasted so much time already. Oh, my God, why does she keep doing that? Stop! Keep jumping! Samus! Keep fucking jumping! Why would I want you to stop? Oh, my God. Stop. She hits them fine, but it's like she cancels out regardless sometimes. Oh my god, do the second jump! Samus! Samus! Do the fucking jump! Well, fuck it. I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. Cool. Damn it. Warning. No entry without authorization. Warning. No entry without authorization. Maybe I'm not even supposed to do that. Maybe I can just run to the right. No? What's going on? Do the thing. Okay, there we go. Oh, it's locked off. Okay, uh... Let's set a save state, because I'm guessing I'm going to need a couple tries at this. Damn it, Samus, do the second jump. Samus, do the second one! Oh my god! Oh my fucking god, come on. Oh my god, stop! Fucking just do the jumps! I can't, like, freeze them or anything. That'd be fucking useful. Jump! Samus! Do the- Fuck- Fucking- <sighs> Hold on, I'm gonna fucking switch the controls around 
to see if I can use the fucking D-pad, because maybe it's just because I keep hitting fucking up too much. Maybe it's because I fucking accidentally hit up on a fucking controller. Cool, that's it, yep, yep, we're good. Okay, now we're gonna go from the top. Oh my God, that's exactly what it's fucking been. There's no one gonna tell me that you can just fucking do it so much easier if you're not pushing up sometimes. Why the fuck is pushing up such a big deal? Are you kidding me? I pushed because I accidentally bumped up sometimes, it would just cancel out. Is that why the little hops happen too? That's stupid. Why is that even an option? Samus, you shouldn't have done that. You ignored your orders. You may have to pay a price for that quite soon. As you can see, the Federation has been secretly working on a Metroid breeding program. For peaceful application only, of course, please understand, but perhaps you already knew of this program's existence? Certainly you must have had doubts when you saw Sector 1, SRX, a faithful replica of the SR388 ecosystem, ideal for raising Alpha, Gamma, Zeta, and even Omega Metroids. This research even uncovered techniques for rapid growth. Imagine creating an Omega from a larval Metroid in days. But that research is finished. The X has smelled out its natural enemy and one of the SAX is on its way here. One? Are you saying there's more than one SAX? Don't be so surprised, Samus. You know that the X reproduced by asexual division. Because of this mechanism, there are now no fewer than ten SAX aboard the station. Samus, you must go. Get out! You stay too long, the SAX will destroy you. Stop only at a navigation room to uplink to me. I don't know how HQ is going to take this, but you need to report to them immediately. Yes, now get going. All right. I don't trust this. The real Adam would have said the same thing about that incident, but he would have softened the blow. He was relentless in his criticism, but he always cared. He was now a machine obsessed with duty. No such compassion could exist in that computer. ball. Samus, jump his ball. So yeah, I guess having, for this entire game, having my, having my controller set up so that I would be, having my controller set up to have the D-pad as analog stick, that's what's been messing me up the entire game. That's what causes the stupid little hops. That's what causes the, the space jump to not work consistently. Okay, sometimes it still just doesn't work. God, it really sucks to use this. It really sucks to use the PlayStation D-pad. This thing is so, so terrible. It's just mushy. I totally understand why now it's just like a secondary thing. Wow, they survived the super bomb? That's incredible. Okay, they only survived one super bomb. Oh, God damn it. What do I do? <sighs> That's, again, another pet peeve. 
when you can do everything at your disposal and it still doesn't let you, it still has some other trick that you're supposed to just figure out. everything surviving the super bombs. Okay. Is this another one where I have to like let it hang out for a bit? Yeah, like kill it. And like let the X parasite do its own thing. Turn into something else, right? Leave them. I'll turn into this fucking guy. Charge. No. That's it. That's all I got. I don't know. Yes, the super bomb? That's like it. That's all I have at my disposal. Yeah, I have no clue. How the fuck do I kill these guys? How do I d take him out? Going to the walkthrough again because it's not fucking making any sense. Blah, 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 blah. Don't care about. I already been through all that. Two charge shots to the back. I thought I hit it with a charge shot in the back. It didn't look like it did any damage. Whatever. I don't need that secret down there. I'm just gonna... Oh no, not fucking two of them. Maybe handle fucking one! God, this is ridiculous! Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Every Metroid game, the first 80% is amazing, and then at the last 20%, they're like, let's just throw in, let's just ramp up the difficulty as high as it possibly could. Leave no stone unturned, you know? Why, why waste the potential? We have a whole game, let's just make it the most game it can be. And it's like, please, God, no. So I have to do the golden. Okay. I have to kill these guys. Then let let the X parasite hang out. Awesome. 
got his ass. No, stop! Fuck! Ah! Oh, okay, okay, fine, 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 fine. I don't care as long as I can get out of here. I just had to take out one. Fine. I am okay with that as long as I don't have to take out both. room or something. I don't have, like, an ice beam or anything. I'm not gonna deal with that shit. Is this the same thing from below? I mean, there's nowhere else to go. This is just bonus, so I don't care. So I guess I just gotta do this platforming ridiculousness. Ah, oh, shit. I can't. I know that's really annoying. Fuck! No. No! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Oh, right, I can fucking do them. Uh, give it to me, give it to me. Thank you. Jesus Christ! Ah, uh, it's Ridley! That guy. Not a fan. Not a fan of that guy. Alright. Yep, yep, yep. He's alive. He's fucking X or whatever. Whoa! Okay, he does look pretty sick. Nope, nope, let me go. Let me go. Sounds terrifying. Alright, alright. I'm just gonna I'm gonna slam him. Ah. See there. I didn't mind that as much because it was consistent. It was clear why I was friggin' losing. Like it was still pretty obnoxious, but it's like I at least understood why it was happening. It's not just a matter of like... Terrifying noise for the news, too. Ah, the light. Alright, come on. Alright, alright, the second pops up. Uh, uh, uh. Don't grab me, please. Corners are your friends. Except for when they're not. Got hammer on him. Jesus. How many phases does he go through? This is phase three. Come on, come on. Just go down. Just go down. Ridley. Ridley, please. You and I both know you're not going to survive this, dude. Just go down already. There we go. And of course, he turns into a Save game. Oh, okay, that's a classic for X. 
not one of the ones that like blasts you with all sorts of beams and nonsense. These ones I don't mind as much. It's the ones that like really get up in your business with the friggin' beams. Give it to me. Give it to me. Ooh, that's the stuff. Screw attack. There it is. I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. All right. Uh, we're a little over an hour, but game is almost up. So let's just let's just power through and finish this. Ah, oh, yeah, just crush them. Ooh, it's good. God, I should have been using the D-pad the whole time. This is so much better. Come on. There you go. There you go, Mrs. Metroid. Saving. Yeah, so, I just, yeah, I, I should have been using a D-pad, which I guess makes sense because it was a GBA game, but like, Jesus, why wasn't it more obvious? Nothing? All right, where do I go? I see. Sorry, I just, I want to finish this. I'm so close to the end that I just, just walk through in it. Apologies if y'all find that uh, underwhelming, but I do not care. It's, I get it. I understand why people can get upset at that, but like, doesn't matter. I'm the one playing the game, not you. If you if you want to see a playthrough with none of that, like don't then go watch something else. I guess. What else can I tell you? Hold on. Where am I or no. It's down here? Right. And there. This the way whoops oh this sucks oh, okay it's still damaging with the charging blast go up there god damn really just immune to all of it huh There we go. That's what I needed to do. Oh, it's just for the power bomb. Where was I supposed to go then? Hold on. Oh. I got a missile over. Okay. Hold on. Nice, huh? 
All right. Continuing forward. Oh, wow. Well, if I must. Then I suppose I should. Ooh, yeah. Screw attack is solid. Oh, okay, I see how they're trying to do this one. Come on, let me do the thing. Thank you. Oh, this guy. I don't even care. I can screw attack all you. Get screwed. Okay. I didn't get that. I feel like I probably got it on one playthrough and then messed up and died and then had to come back around. Well, since we're here, let's just, uh, let's just 100% this area as best we can. Aw, oh, the platforms are screwable too. Ho oh, ho 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 ho. Nice. Just run right through here. I can jump his ball, baby! And I do this before. I guess because it's just a save point. Whatever, I'll save. And I gotta get back over there. Get out of here. I think I give a toot. I didn't give fun toot about any of that. I'm just here to get out of this rotten place. I'm just here to leave. I can't believe it. And I want to go. Gotcha. Why didn't I do that before? Weird. Recovery room, please. Recovery, recharge, whatever you want to call it, give it to me. Oh, actually, there's a secret over here. Let me go do that real quick. There's definitely something here. Aha! Screw attack, 
Facebook.com, the place where you go. You've been there. You've been, you've been, you saw. You saw the videos they got. All right. Finishing her off. Save data. Fully stocked up, 155 missiles. That sounds like plenty to me. My God, yeah, I should have been doing the D and D, the D pad the whole time. All right, Samus, we're done here. Leave the rest to the Federation. We should be preparing to evacuate the station. Are you joking? Did they know how dangerous the X are? How quickly they reproduce? The Federation has taken an interest in the X and SAX. They believe this life form has endless potential applications. This is ridiculous. The X are heartless abominations. What potential could they have? It's not necessary that you understand such matters. The Federation is coming now. You should just leave quietly. This is madness. They won't stand a chance here. The station will devour them. What could be worth the risk? Capturing the SAX, of course. Are you serious? Do they really think they can succeed? It will certainly be difficult. They don't expect your help. They knew you would try to destroy the SAX. That's why they stopped sending you support data. The plasma beam modification was raised some time ago, but they withheld it to keep you from engaging the SAX. Yet somehow you restored that function on your own. They also tried to withhold the diffusion missile upgrade because they didn't want you to grow too powerful. But they had already sent it and you tracked it down. Bravo, Samus. They must cancel this mission. Open a channel to HQ. I won't let this happen. They are already on their way. You fools. As soon as the Federation ships land, the X will overwhelm them and absorb the knowledge and power of their occupants. The X are just waiting for the hurt to er, for the hunt to begin, then they'll spread across the universe. Galactic civilization will end. The X hunger for form, knowledge, and power. They mimic these perfectly, but they cannot copy the soul. They're single-minded, instinctively seeking to increase a number. They're a plague, and the Federation underestimates their threat. The X must not leave here. I must destroy them all before the Federation arrives. The station has a self-destruct mechanism. I must use it to destroy the X here and on the planet. I must send them to oblivion. Them, the station, and myself, if I have to. Can I leave now? Open the hatch. I've been ordered to confine you until the ships arrive. Don't let them do this. You can't see what will happen, Adam? Adam? Who is Adam? A friend of mine? And what would this friend advise you to do now? You would know that the only way to end this is to start the self-destruct cycle. He'd know how important it is. Would this Adam care for you? Would he sit in a safe command room and order you to die? He would understand that some must live and some must die. He knew what it meant. He made that sacrifice once. So he chose life for you, our fair warrior, Samus Aaron. Your Adam gave his life so that you might keep yours for the sake of the universe. How foolish. How dare you? How could you hope to understand, machine? You know that deadening this station in high orbit would not guarantee the complete extinction of the X-Parasites, even though the station would be utterly destroyed. You would only succeed in removing the one obstacle to the galaxy's ruin, yourself. You would ignore this simple fact and choose death. When Adam decided who would live, he chose incorrectly. If you were to alter the station's orbit, then you might be able to include the planet in the vaporization field of the self-destruct detonation. Huh? You would have to start the propulsion sequence now, before the Federation arrives. Samus, this is your last mission. Go to the operations room and adjust the station's orbit path to, in to intercept SR-388. Then return to your ship and escape. Move quickly and stay alive. That's an order. Any objections, lady? Oh! Twer Atom. Or at least it overheard me talking about Atom. I don't know. Here we go. Here we go. It's the end. Probably swarming with SAXs.
I don't give a toot. I'll take him on right in here, right now. What the heck is in here? That's it? Power bomb upgrade? Ah. Just got that. That's cool. It's like in a. Uh, Metroid 2. There were parts where you just like went into the wall and just kind of had to blindly power bomb around. Ah. Uh. That's the way back out. Hmm. Well, I don't really need it. I'll be honest, I just want to finish this right now, so I'm glad I know what's in there for future casual runs. Um, as things are now. It's really not that important to me to get two more power bombs. All right. I swear. Some something else. I don't know, something feels off. Huh. I don't know, I guess we'll find out. It's probably gonna be a mad dash away from the SAX to get to my ship. Here we go. Yep, I knew this was coming. Ah! That's fine, the save point wasn't too far back. I will be sure to make a safe state, though. Just to save a little time. Because I'm probably going to need a couple of tries at this one as well. Because it's hard. Do it. All right. Save. Save. And in fact, I'm going to quickly add quick save, quick load. So let's say we'll put quick save to that and quick load to that. Or no, I will put, that'll be that. Quick load can be up. Nope, I'm using brick. Um, R3, yeah, I'm not using R3 for anything. Okay, cool. All right, let's do this. She might be me, but she ain't know how to use it like I does. Okay, maybe she does. Uh 
Oh. Oh, she's falling apart. Ah, dang it. Uh. Ah, I forgot to actually make the save point or whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever. <laughs> yeah, maybe I did. I don't know. I guess the quick save and the regular save aren't the same thing. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, I don't want to hit the... I don't want to hit that because I don't remember if I actually made a safe state or not. If I just considered it. Alright, big thing is don't screw attack because she will also screw attack me and it hurts a lot. It is a painful way to go. Right. Now if I... Okay, there we go. It's like Shadow Link all over again. Can't tell how much damage I've done. Feels like because she's flashing, that seems like a lot. Ah, crap. Alright, she has to come to me up here. Gotta bait her back down into this right corner. I'm generally pretty good. Yeah. Full charge will do it, but it takes a minute. Taking a good deal of my health down. I'm doing okay. Oh my god, how many times do we have to hit her? Ah! I can't even tell. Hold on, let me see what the what the walkthrough says for strategy, because I feel like this is a pretty solid strategy. All right, main deck, end of the game. Uh, da, da, da. Stick to the low ground and fire charge beam shots directly at the SCX. Your beam must be fully charged to damage it. As it approaches, space jump over to the other side of the floor. Oh, it only takes 10 to get it out of this first form? Okay. Huh. I feel like I've hit it a good 10 times at least. Oh my 
I guess it is like losing its Samus form, so. Ah, there it is. Alright. Oh, Jesus. Ew. I hate it. Classic boss stuff. Oh, geez. Okay, I just gotta get in close. Oh, oh, I did it! Yes. Ah, no, not one of these. Ah, fine. Okay. This area sucks to do this in, but... God, it does. It fucking turns to face me. Hold on, I gotta perform some health drops. God, where'd they go? same time. Oh my god. I love this core X idea thematically, but holy shit, it's so obnoxious in practice. Oh, come on, you bastard. Oh, I can't even go to the recovery room. All right, well, I'm gonna quick save just in case. All right, here we go. Set her off. Three minutes to impact. Here we go. I got this, I got this. Well, let me go through now. That's fine. I'm not even that far away, so this is gonna be pretty easy. Yeah, I'm like three rooms away. Well, okay, I'm like eight rooms away, but that's not too bad. Yeah. 
And this is gonna be a little foolish, but I'm gonna re recharge real quick. Just in case I run into like a boss or some nonsense. Actually, I don't want the secret way. What am I doing? Oh, frick. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna quick load from over here because I forgot which way I was supposed to be going. Ah, I'm so stupid. This music is like fast-paced, but it's like it's kind of chill and understated for this particular sequence. Yeah, I remember that these bitches are screw attackable. Oh. Uh oh. Oh boy. No! My ship! Oh. Oh no. Wait, what's your guy? What's this guy's deal? Figured the SAX was the oh oh wait ah uh, this is scripted no please <gasps> a friendly guy <gasps> the SAX is helping me what oh my god I don't know why it has such a change of heart but nice yes. Ah, it's got the ice. So it just kind of does little stompies. Please, no. Please, let me up. Let me Oh, I should have. I should have done a quick save, huh? Oh well, I'll be okay. I'm already getting pretty far back. Ah. All right, let's. Yeah. Okay, I'll do a quick save after I, I get the SAX there. I'm very close. That's gonna be the last guy for sure. Come on, come on. Yes, my friend. There we go. Let me up, let me up, let me up. Let me up. Let me up. Silly. Come on, come on. Oh, come on. How much do I have to do to get him to jump back? It's like he'll start scooting back if you hit him enough. Yeah, like there. Come on, come on. 
Oh, come on. It's really hard to gauge, like, what part of his chin you can shoot under. Nope, there we go. Oh, you can get up much faster if you hail the directional buttons, too. I got him! I got him! Yes! <gasps> Friends? Can I get on? Let me on, let me on. Yes! Yes! Save the animals. Animals save you. That's right, baby. It's canon. We did it! Metroid was fused. That perfect military mind. The wisdom of Adam Malkovich continued to serve even after death. Until today, I had no idea that the minds of leaders and scientists were frequently uploaded to computers. My incredible reunion with Adam may have saved the universe. Okay. But how will the beings of the universe view our resolve? I doubt they will understand what we did, the danger we barely averted. They will hold tribunals and investigations. They will hold us responsible. Adam understood this, and he spoke to me in my anger. One second. All right. Do not worry. One of them will understand. One of them must. I've reflected upon his words, and I see the wisdom in them. We are all bound by our experiences. They are the limits of our consciousness. But in the end, the human soul will ever reach for the truth. This is what Adam taught me. Just one detail still bothers me. This ship can only be started manually. Yet before I faced the Omega Metroid, the ship moved on its own, guided by someone's hands. Is it possible? Adam? Adam! Lady, what's troubling you? Or what's troubling you? You wonder how I started the ship? Just think about it. They lent me a hand. Oh, babies. Friends. Hmm, baby bird. It was them all along. Nice, nice, what a great way to end it. All right, and I guess there is a better secret ending if you get, like, all the secrets or something. Or maybe that's the best ending. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, that'll do it for this. Uh, I think I will play some Zero Mission. We're still pretty early into the stream, so I'll be right back with that in just a bit. So you guys, enjoy the credits. Go stretch. Go do all you're going to do. And uh, I will be back in just a bit with some Metroid Zero Mission. So don't go anywhere. Don't touch that internet dial some zero mission in just a few minutes.
Only 45%. Oh, I'm gonna have to fix that someday in the future. All right, back on break.
Hey, everybody, we are back. Ooh, perfect timing. It's zero mission now. Um, hopefully it updated my stuff correctly. Sometimes when it, you do it in the app, uh, it doesn't update everything, but it should say zero mission now. And uh, yeah, we're gonna play some zero mission. Uh, I'll just start, file C. I was testing it out to make sure there weren't any issues with the capture or anything uh, before beforehand. So that was just a test file up top. Planet Zebes. I called this place home once in peaceful times, long before evil haunted the caverns below. Now I shall finally tell the tale of my first battle here, my so-called Zero Mission. Samus Aran. This one? That's fair. I mean, Metro, Metro Dread could disappoint. I don't know. People have been streaming it, I saw. So probably they got it early at GameStop or something. Because I know GameStop lets you get stuff pretty early or whatever. But uh, yeah, let's let's do it. I really enjoyed Fusion. Um, I, f I figured out the reason I was having so much trouble with the jumps and she was doing the weird little hops and stuff. It's because I was using the analog stick. I use a PlayStation 4 controller for my emulator. And yeah, using the analog stick, I guess, just really messes with the... Um, with the inputs, so once I figured that out, like the space jump was so much more consistent. She didn't do little hops anymore, so I figured it out at the very end of the game, but at least I figured it out eventually. All right, this does look pretty great. Ah! Do, 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 do. Oh, oh. Hmm. I know, I hate the the PS4 D-pad so much. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, cool, a map. I appreciate that. Yeah, the when I tried playing the original Metroid, I understand why it didn't do didn't have much more like usability. Because, like, it was the NES, whatever. The fact they could get Metroid even going on an NES is still pretty surprising. Um, but... Yeah, yeah, this D-pad sucks. Uh, I do have the USB one, but it's plugged into my Switch, and I don't feel like switching it out right now. I'm really excited for when the N64 Bluetooth controller comes out. I will use that, because it's got a Nintendo D-pad and everything. And if you hold it like that, it basically feels like a SNES controller with a, uh, with a, uh, with the, with the, the stems, the sticks hanging down like a controller's got, ah, whoop, oh, graze me, graze me just a little bit, ah, not quite. Wow. Yeah, these vertical hallways are really long. Like, this is this is so much space that I'm having to climb up. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah, this is, you know, once I've gotten the um yeah, once I've gotten the morph bomb believe this is nope the long beam never mind I I got the long beam and I got the morph bomb in my last playthrough that was about it um, and that was the original Metroid of course this is the remake of the original so it's a little smoother and it's a little more user-friendly but it's the same design, technically. I, I do appreciate it because it lets you see the things they were trying to do that were kind of difficult. You know, I'd love to see something like this with the original Zelda, maybe? Where it's like, it's the same game, but there's like a little more direction. 
It's like, it's fun to explore, but it's like, good to know where I need to go at least, so that I can decide if I want to go there yet or not. Ah, dang it. Also feels like there's a lot less enemies than were in the original Metroid. Oop, oop. Ah, oh, the spicy soup. That's really, that's really foreboding. Yeah, I think I will probably 100% um, Metroid Fusion at some point. Because I really loved it. The bosses were annoying, but like now that I know the whole D-pad situation, it's like, I get the feeling that it honestly will be a lot more doable. I only got 45% though, which is pretty surprising. I went after like as much of the secrets as I could find. I guess I didn't do a lot of backtracking was the big thing. Uh-oh. Hmm. What am I doing wrong? Oh, wait. This guy can be helpful. Healed. See, even that alone makes this like a much more manageable game. It's not technically necessary, but it's like, with a game this hard, having some health refills is super fucking helpful. Huh, I guess I do just gotta go around. Hmm. Oh, oh, that's what's up. I don't know why that didn't pop up last time. But I got it. Where am I headed next? Chowtsi? Chozu? Chirum Chirumzo? Hmm. Thanks, bud. Chozo, right? That's what they're called? Okay. Ouch. Ooh. Getting a little close there. No, thank you. No, thank you if you wouldn't mind, I'd rather not. Oh, oh, oh! Ah. Can't quite get up there. Can I go up that way? What the heck? Oh, what's this? Get it off! Get it off! Ugh, I don't like it. Oh, thank you. Ooh, gross. According to estimates, this game takes like four and a half hours. I might, you know, finish it another time, but I'm just gonna get through some of the beginning stuff here. Oh, well that's friendly. Um, yeah, because I, I already, I just finished Fusion, which was great. Now I just, just want to, you know, beef up the stream a little bit. I'm going to be playing Dread all weekend on here, so tune in for that. But, um, for right now, I'm just hanging out, playing some Zero Mission. It's really easy. I got super used to her like grabbing onto ledges, so now that she won't do it, it's really throwing me off. Uh-oh. That feels concerning. Hey. 
Nobody asked you. See, these guys already are more manageable. They, like, respawn immediately in the actual original Metroid, and it's a nightmare. There's R and B. And it is hold, so yeah, it's basically the fusion engine. Cool. It's me. Thank you. Oh! Oh, a boss! A boss right here? Well, that's different. Ouch, ouch. Oh, that's genius. It's a remake, but they're just like, let's throw in a boss here to really throw off anybody who's familiar with the series. That's super clever. I love that. Ow, ow, ow. And you don't even have to beat him? That's also pretty slick. So it's an optional boss, basically. And I presume you get some kind of bonus if you actually fin finish him off, or he's gonna come back later and I'm gonna have to fight him. Something like that. This game's pretty neat. It's also got... I, the thing about Nintendo games was that there was great micro progression. On the macro, you know, sometimes it'd be like, well, you don't ever really go that far. But like on the micro progression, it's just it always feels like you, you're doing something. You're you're moving on. It's always a super satisfying feeling to just keep keep going on. And every every minute or so, you'll find something new. Looks. Take it out, take it out, take it out. Ooh, I don't like it. Gross. Mm. Oh, I see. I see what happened here. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Please, please, sirs. Ah, ah. My health's very low. No, thank you. No, thank you. Oh, man, they don't even give you, like, health drops, really. That's a little annoying. How fast can I do it? Tapping. Hold on, is there a secret? That kind of looks like... Ah, I guess not. Uh, okay. Uh-oh. Yeah, he's back. Oops. Oops, shush, shush. Please, no. Please don't. Oh, 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 whoa, moving around. Crap. Ah, uh, missiles. Can I... Yes, missile drops. Missiles and health, nice. Whoop. Uh, uh, uh. E tank. Yes. Yeah, this is a fantastic remake. Like, graphically, sure, everything's all fixed up. And, like, the controls are a little tighter. But, like, wow, this, is, this just feels like such a great way to remake this. And, like, they added, like, a reasonable amount of extra stuff without it feeling, like, overburdened with additional content. See point. Yeah, it feels like Metroid really had its heyday on the GBA. And, like, 
All, both of these GBA games have been real solid. Ah, oh, yeah. Where am I at now? Ooh, what do we got? Bump. Morph bump. Press B and morph ball form to set. Weapons and energy fully restored. Cannot jump his ball. Whoops. Whoops. Dang it. Got kind of. Whoop. You gotta time it just right. Nice. Now that I have the morph balls, I can freaking do this bit. Which was a bad idea! No! Ah! Please, no thank you. Aw, oh, what the heck? That's it? <laughs> it was just a trap? That's dumb. There's not her fair. Brinstar nor fair. The whole deal. Oh yeah, I gotta loop back around. To use these bombs I just got. Whoops. Ooh, ow, ooh. Ah, ah. Spicy. Spicy soup. Ah, out, out. Frank. Oh my god. <laughs> I keep missing these jumps. It's alright, it's alright. Figured I'd need to go to Norfair, but I appreciate it. Hmm. So how is uh, Samus Returns, the like DS, the 3DS remake of Metroid 2? Because it feels like that would be the way to experience that one as well. So if I remember, the, the GBA one was fine, but, or rather the GB one was fine, but nothing special. Um, in that, like, it was just very limited, you know? It was similar to the NES one. It was just two buttons, D-pad, you're good. Your basic. Rapid fire. Rapid fire. Secrets. Ah, 
Whoops. Hmm. Dang it, I accidentally hit up a little bit. Hey, there we go, I got it. See, as with most Metroid games, it's a delight in the beginning when you're just, you're finding stuff, you know, there's some, there's some hard parts, but you're just, you're just exploring. And then, about, you know, a couple hours later. Come on. Uh, just got to time it right. God, they don't even give you health drops. These enemies are nonsense, dude. No health drops. Constantly in your way. Just like real gnats. Oops! Can't jump his ball! Can't jump his ball! Still, still the best part of Metroid Fusion. Can't jump his ball. Ah, right here. Can't jump his ball. It's really interesting how, like, tight Samus's, uh, jumps are. Sometimes just the tiniest bit of a slope will determine how how far you can go. Rather, how high you can go. All right. There's like no fuse on these bombs. Literally takes like one, one friggin' second for them to go off. Just a little too high. No, no, no. Thank you. All right. You know, for this game, I think I could probably turn up the uh, audio a little bit. Negative nine. Negative nine seems like a good spot for it. Ah, this 
I gotta come back here later. Well, I got the missile tank. So, gotta go to Norfair. Probably down to Turian at some point, too. Well, let's head for Norfair for now. Save again. All right. Oh, it's coming. All right. Finally, going to get you. Fair time, baby. The mother brain. She's bubbling. She's waking up. No. Uh, let me hold on. I'm gonna check something. Uh, a friend of mine who runs a Discord server where I usually post up uh, links to this. Set it up so that it should be posting links to my stuff. Yeah! Nice! It did work. So now I don't have to post a link in his, uh, his server every time. Whoa! Oh, school talk. Uh-oh. I should probably save first. The, implica the implication with that is it like. Does it reclone? Is it like a regrowth thing? Just gonna move some drops real quick. guys. Hmm. I guess I 
think I get some kind of jump. Some kind of jump maneuver. Oh, gotta get the run. I ain't playing around with that. If you want to play around with that, feel free, but I ain't playing around with that. Surprisingly, uh, pretty easy. Wow, yeah, this thing, this game controls like a dream. It's hard to describe, but the the platforming is so like chunky. I don't know. That's the only word I can think of for it. Boy, thanks. I was a superior system, the most system jumped back in the day. Alright, I made it. I did it. I got the bonus. This is great! Super run and gun fun times. Uh, whoa. That's great. Oh yeah, stacking the uh, stacking the explosions is actually much easier in this than it was in really any any other one I've played. myself here. It's alright. Just hop up in here. Hop right up there. Back to Criteria. To the right. Very sluggish in the water. How did they do water in the original Metroid? That can't be. That has to have been something new to this, right? There's no way that they could have done, like, water physics on the NES, could they? That's incredible, if so. Inclusive. Item incompatible with current suit. So that's what's up. Wow, yeah, this is fantastic. Ah, there we go. No, none of this could have been on the original NES, I don't think. Maybe it could have. Maybe I'm really underestimating what the original NES could do. This feels like it's way too much. Uh-oh. Oh, this is a boss, isn't it? Oh, no. Whoa, 
what is that? Power grip? What's the power grip? Grab and hang from ledges and corners. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Now I gotta what, like, platform my way back up? That's pretty cool. Oh, you gotta like hold towards it. Okay, that's an interesting surprise. This is totally different. Like it's it's a remake for the most part, but they definitely added like a lot of content. It feels like. To be clear, I'm not super familiar with the original Metroid, so I could just be wrong, but. Am I back? Oh my god, I'm back in my ship. Oh my god. Let me save. Yes. Wow, this is great. This is this is so much more than I expected it to be. And I expected it to be pretty good, but like, wow, they really went all out on this. Ah, speed time. Not yet, not yet. Oh, this is really blowing my mind. This game's really good. That's how you get down to the original elevator. Right? Oh, oh this is cool. Rather, not the original elevator, but you know. Around there. Now I can power grip. Back up there! Oh my god! Oh, that's so cool! I guess that's what you were supposed to do in that little secret area. Whoops. Oh well. It doesn't matter too much. Eh, I'm only one shy. Oh god, he's chasing. Ah, he got me. He got me just a little bit. It's okay, I'm proud of him. No. Samos. Samos. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, this platforming is sublime. Oh, this power grip changes it so much. Really makes it feel just oh, so solid. Ice beam. 
Nice. This beam can freeze enemies in place. You can safely stand on frozen enemies. Nice. Uh, let me actually heal up here. Grip. Grip and grab the bowl. Oh my god, I'm I'm seriously adoring this. Like I, everybody's like Zero Mission is a remake, and I'm like, yeah, okay, sounds pretty cool, sounds like a, a way to do it. But it's like, this is really good. Like this is an incredible way to handle a remake. It's graphically better. They added a ton of different content. They added like this power grip thing, just mwah, beautiful. Uh oh. I think I got it. Good. Oops, oops, oops. Oh, you can't power grip them, though. That's okay. Must make ladder. Must make stairway to or away from Hyopian. Ah, too far. Too far. It. There you go. There we go. I mean, I never said it was lackluster. It's just like, I expected it to just be like the original NES game, which is fine, but you know, dated with just updated graphics. But like, they really went out of their way to make something friggin' amazing. Oh, back in Brinstar, huh? What do you got? What do you got? No, no, Kraid! Kraid is just his own whole area, huh? Well, yeah, I presume there's something after I beat the boss. Timing on these guys is a little silly. Oh, yeah, totally. I already have Dread pre-ordered. I'm going to be playing it, like, all weekend. Uh, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna play some tomorrow, and, like, all weekend I'm going to have a stream on Sunday. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday playing Dread. So, real excited for that. I've, I have over... Playing these, I have become actually a pretty big fan of the Metroid series. This is no ah uh, dang it. It was a trick. Trap. Ooh, ow. Ooh, spicy room. No thank you. I like my rooms mild, thanks. Uh, where are we at? Uh, well I do want that missile upgrade, so. Let me hop back through there. Ah, nope. Oh my god, this power grip. Ah, it's such a good platforming mechanic. It's so, so simple. You just are able to grab ledges and it just makes it amazing. So good, so good. Also, the little, like, after image as she jumps is really nice. You know, it's just a small detail, but, like, it, it makes for a very nice visual. It really makes you feel the power of the jump. There we go. There we go. Well, well, he came, but it was fine. I made it over regardless. Also, I gotta say, man, this the ice beam. The ice beam is such a, a great idea for, like, again, like, 
it's it's so classic, but it's like it just feels so good to be able to turn your enemies into platforms. This where. Ah, ah. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. I think I'll be okay. Famous last words, but who cares? We're going back to Kraid, baby. I don't mean, look like I could get down there. No, wait. I gotta. I gotta get the runny shoes for that. That's what's up. Health drops are pretty stingy in this one, I gotta say. Thankfully, the difficulty has been kinda not ratcheted down so much, but like smoothed over, where it's like still pretty challenging, but it feels like fair, you know? Oh, I actually needed the ice beam even to go back here. Did not realize. Samus, please. <laughs> Samus! Samus, please! Oh, and I need it. Ah. No. Oh, whew. I was about to be very upset if I had to do that again. Alright, back to Brinstar. We're going after Kraid, baby. Um, I don't remember what was holding me back. Here, there was something I couldn't get quite yet. Oops. Well, that's not great, but whatever. My bad, my bad. Ah. Give me your health. Hmm? Still gotta fight that centipede creature at some point. Save again. The save rooms feel a lot more plentiful too. Maybe I just wasn't exploring very well when I played Metroid uh, on the NES the NES online thing. But uh, yeah, it feels like it's a lot more generous this time around. It looks like you're gonna fall down there. It's hard to envision it as, like, a hallway that's safe. I might be able to go... I don't know if I can go do that. I don't know how to get down to Kraid. There's something to collect down here, so let's go to do that for right now. Oh, wait a minute. I know a secret when I see one. Use this, use the power grip, maybe. Right? Yeah! Yeah, that's a secret, all right. Now there's so many guys. Oh, there it is. Hey, Mr. Tank. Nice. I think I need over a hundred of missiles to defeat Mother Brain, so I'll try and get as many as I can. Ah, frick. Well, it's marked on the map, at least. This game's real good. D uh, question. Does it actually say Metroid Zero Mission right now? Because I changed it in the app, but sometimes it takes it a while um, to actually change in the app. So, I'm, I'm not sure to name it. Did. Here. What? Here. Hmm. Oh yeah, I can do this now. So that's cool. I think this is the way to create. 
Yes, it is. Oh. <laughs> okay, cool. I'm I'm glad it's it's updated. I love this little face. Look at this guy. This seems like a pleasant fella. Can't go under there. Okay. Alright. Here we go. Here we go, boys and girls. Craid. Save first. As always. Yeah, that's the thing is I'd never beat the original Metroids because like they were just brutally hard. But like now I've beaten two of the Metroids in the last like couple weeks. The last like month, I guess. Oh geez, beefy boys. They're quite strong. Charge beam thing? That's my guess is charge beam, but uh, alright. I have to swing back the way I came. <laughs> He's coming! He's coming! Yeah, being able to mash really helps in this game. Oh, oh no! Ha 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 ha! Spicy! Yeah! Uh, oh no, thank you. Grab it. Fine. You can't jump his ball. Oh, I need the spider ball here, right? Oh, wait. No, I guess. That's just, that's just Metroid. Metroid is a game of, I'll, I'll be back eventually. Or maybe I won't. Time will die. Go, ooh, ah, no, no, no. Get out of my way, get out of my way, get out of my way. Move, move. Oh my God, oh my God. This is bad, this is bad, this is real bad. Ah! Turn to game. Oof. Uh, so can you run in this game, I guess? Like, I, I presume you'll eventually be able to run, but like, can you just hit the run like in Super Metroid? Can't tell. originally and not a guy? Or is it both? 
is Kraid himself going to pop up around here, or is this just like a misnomer, like everybody just calls him Kraid because he was in Kraid? His actual name is Gabrul or something. was a track. Ah. Oh, that's what it is, huh? Okay. That was really satisfying. Oh, but now how do I get up? I guess I just got... Yep, this bomb thing. Gotcha. Nice! That's super satisfying. That was great. Um, I want to just jump down like a dunce. Like a dullard. Goosey with my stuff. Is this, is this it? Is this where I have to figure it out? You must be ball. Yeah. Stuff. 
cool. Okay. Map. That's what he means, map. Okay. Yes. And the goods. Find out. Ah, another one of these. No, not how to do it. Oops. I missed up. time it looks like it was a shortcut. Ah! this time. Yes. Yes. Oh my god, this is great. It pulls you back into the save room. Oh my god. That's good stuff. Uh-oh. 
Uh-oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, I see. Just that extra bit. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. That's not what I meant. See, if he misses you, he seems so unthreatening, but if he gets you, it's just like, jeez, it's so horrible. does that, it's gonna raise first. He'll immediately do that. After that, he's out for a second, doesn't raise it. There we go. Nice. All right, what's the secret? What do I get? What do I get? What's my secret? Come on, I don't get anything from that. I don't get like a you're good Metroid reward. Hmm. Even like a missile tank? Well, I guess I did just like turn on all the things, so. Okay. Bam. Aha, now I can use them. Use them, or maybe even abuse them? I'll never tell. my tank. Save. 
uh, not quite the top of the hour, but I did go hour 40 for my first chunk with uh, Fusion. So I'm gonna take a break, but I think I'm gonna go for another hour. I'm feeling really good with this one. So uh, I'll be right back in just a minute. Don't go anywhere. Don't touch the internet dial. I'll be right back with more Zero Mission in just a minute.
All right, I'm back. Gonna do, yeah, gonna do another hour of this. I don't want to go too late because I do have like a work thing I gotta do still. Um, but there's not like a huge rush on. Should I do now? I should be fine. But yeah, I'm having a great time with this, so let's keep going. Uh, I did actually do that one. Cool. Right. Okay. Jump into the thing, Sam. Ah! No, 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 no. Nice. Ah, frick. But I want in. I want in. Oh, well. Okay, I'll have to do that one later. like locks in the way. I remember running into that. This might be it. Yeah, okay, this is the one I was thinking of. Hmm, let's see what's going on over there. I'm here first. Oh god, he's a big boy. Okay, cool. Okay. There we go. Nice missile tank acquired. Oh, okay, I thought it was one of the blasties, but I guess not. Oh, get over here, bud. Whoop. Alright, we're moving on. Moving right along. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Please. Please give it to me. Give me the thing. Well, that guy, yeah, actually. That is not what is holding me back from that part. And I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm, I'm pretty glad that this ended up being a. A, a pretty fun game, because uh, I was having kind of a rough day. I don't know. Just, like, real tired. My neck has been really out of whack, because I, like, was sitting wrong. Um, I'm feeling pretty good. Having a good time. Come on, you son of a butt. Uh, uh. Maybe I gotta turn that from a different angle. for missile tank so I can come back.
ball hop it. Oh, come on. I can do this. Oh, oh, yeah, there it is. Oh, yeah, now I can do as ball. Nice. Missile? How do I miss that? Worked hard for that. All right, that's map room. Some of this. guys and see if I can do runs. Can I run? No. Wait, do I need to turn one of those guys into a platform? Is that what's up here? Step one of this puzzle figured out. Oops. Guess I can't frost them twice. though. That's the first step is just figuring out what they want you to do. Next step is doing it. Come on, friend. Okay. I got it. Ah, 
prick. He's dead. He's dead. Oh, God damn it! it's much simpler than I thought making it out to be. Yep, there it is. Okay, I just gotta get it going the other direction. Frick, it's so much simpler. I was way overthinking it with all this freezing and nonsense. My controller died. Hold on. Oh no. That sucks. Well, let's see if I can finish this up. Uh, no. Ah. Uh. Second time. Come on, turn back on, baby. Turn back on. Turn back on. Okay. I'm gonna give it. Oh. Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. We're stuck. Okay. Nope. That's it. Controller's dead. Well, I wanted to go for a little while longer, but unfortunately, that's gonna be it, guys. So, uh, one second. Let me do my outro. Skeltinger for a second. There we go. Okay. Thanks for watching, everybody. Unfortunately, this is where it's going to have to end because my controller is dead, and I don't want y'all to sit around while I'm charging it. Uh, let me quit out of this program so that OBS can handle the camera. Hello? I said yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be the outro. But, um, Thank you very much for inviting me into your home computer, tablet, laptop, gaming console, Roku, Apple TV, however it is you watch today. I hope I brought some entertainment and levity into your life. I hope you'll watch, you know, in the past, the present, the future, all that. Past broadcast tab, Iggy Kid Twitch Archive. That's Iggy Kid Twitch Archive. Link down below along with my personal YouTube, Iggy and the Ape. Check out that. Follow and subscribe. Use your Twitch Prime sub, which just link your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch account, and you get... Uh, free, free sub a month. Use it on me. I appreciate it because I know you will. Please follow me on Twitter at IggyDKid and yeah, join me f uh, for the whole weekend. Tomorrow, Saturday, Sunday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, all three. I'm going to be playing some Metroid Dread, so super stoked on that. I will probably honestly play more Zero Mission later because this is, this is a really fun game. But in any case, thanks for watching. Hope I brought some entertainment and levity into your life. Hope you have a great rest of your day, and hey, if no one else has told you this, I'll tell you this. You're a good kid. Thanks for watching, everybody. Let me see if there's anyone to raid over to real quick. Uh, Hasanabi is a little, little too uh, rich for my blood. <laughs>
Uh, oh, Ruyarin is playing Super Metroid. Perfect. So yeah, let's let's swing y'all over to Ruyarin. Um, yeah. Let me make sure I spell that right. Turn that down. All right. Looks like he just started a new run. Sweet. All right. Let me let me type that in. Read. Ruyarin. All right. Let him know I sent you. Enjoy some Super Metroid. Come back around for some Metroid Dread tomorrow. All right, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. Good night. Goodbye.